Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today, I got some news for you. First of all, the NBA All-Star Voting has their first return of the votes. As you know by the thumbnail and the title, uh, it's Luka Doncic who's in first place right now, but stay tuned to see the other All-Stars so far. Second of all, Carmelo Anthony had his first return to Madison Square Garden this season. Um, and some other funny stuff happened there, stay tuned for that. And the third thing is that one player is finally living up to his potential, so stay tuned for that. Guys, if this is your first time here, smash the like button to help me out with the YouTube algorithm and subscribe so you won't miss my next video. You done that, right? Alright, so let's go. As you see, I got my screen recording up now. And first of all, the Western Conference. LeBron James is obviously in first place. I, I, I um, calculated that and I thought that LeBron James, LeBron James will be the uh, number one motor player. But as you see, that's Luka Doncic. And as you see, for the guards. But from Court Western Conference, LeBron James, Anthony Davis, Kawhi Leonard. I predicted that, um, as you see in the video right here. And then Paul George, Carl Anthony Towns, Porzingis, Jokic, Carmelo Anthony would be nice. But yeah, let's see. Ben Ingram is having a good season. And Dwight Howard. Dwight Howard is also having a very good season after a lot of seasons where he had some problems with his behavior he's doing pretty good in Los Angeles with the Lakers with LeBron AD and so on so yeah he deserved that he the magic Dwight Howard was an insanely beasty center and yeah he's doing pretty good now so I'm happy for him and Thing is also good. Yeah, I'm totally fine with that list. Coming to the guards, as I said, Luka Doncic is the number one voted player in the whole entire NBA. That's crazy because he's so freaking young. You always forget that Luka Doncic is just 20 years old. He's born in 1999. Like, come on! He's just 20. 1999, for me that's like he's 17, but yeah, that, they are already 20. <laughs> and yeah, so yeah, he's that, that kid is crazy. His step backs, his triple doubles, like he's crazy good. He's crazy good and he deserved that. He deserved that. And James Harden also deserved the second spot because James Harden is a scoring machine. Dan Lillard, Curry, Westbrook, D'Angelo Russell, Donovan Mitchell, Alex Caruso. Come on, everyone loves Alex Caruso. Come on, of course. The Book and Ja Morant. Mm, I'm, I'm also, I'm, I'm seeing that. Alex Caruso, I want to sit a little bit higher. Alex Caruso should go to the All-Star game, no? That would be funny, at least to the dunk contest, at least to the dunk contest. And then Giannis deserved MVP. Joel Embiid is not having the best season, but the competition in his the division in his conference is not that high, so I'm fine with that. Siakam, Butler. I thought that Siakam would be second and Butler would be third. So Embiid will be fourth, but okay. Then Jason Tatum, Taco Fall. How many minutes does he have played? I think he played like 30. Around that, he just played like 30 games and averaged like four points around that, I don't know. But yeah, it's something around that and that will be also pretty that's just something for the fans. No, that that's just it would be funny, but yeah. <laughs> ben on the bias having a good, a good season. Gordon Hayward. Um, I don't know. Andre Drummond, the Montes Sabonis, they are good. 
Gordon Hayward, I don't know. He was injured twice, I think. And so I don't know. Then Trey Young, best guard in the East. Kyrie's also hurt. Kemba Walker, D Rose would be, D Rose would be having a good season. Like the stats are like pretty pretty much the same of his all-star season, so that would be yeah, I got the CD Rose man. He 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 had some problems with his knees. And yeah, he's having a good season. Zach Levine also. Ben Simmons is a little bit low, right? But he's not playing that good like last season, so Ben, Jalen Brown, Kai Lowry, Bradley Beal should be higher, I think. And Spencer Dinwiddie. Yeah, Spencer Dinwiddie is not so popular, but he's having a pretty good season. Because of him, the Mets are in the playoff spot. Because, yeah, Kyrie Irving is injured and they don't have, like, their three best players are injured. Kyrie, Katie, and Kerry Slavert. And yeah, they need a score. And he's their main guy right now. So yeah, he deserved that. He deserved that top 10 spot. Spencer in with him. So we get so yeah guys, this has been the all-star so far. I think this is pretty yeah, pretty correct. Like Eric Caruso and Taco Fall would be funny to see in the all-star game. But yeah, let's see who gets in there if you want to vote for the NBA All-Stars check out my other video you'll see how you can do it it's pretty simple but I saw today here there are two for one days as you see and this is on January 2nd January 3rd that's today yes right then January 10th 16th and 20th so if you want your guys to Get up there in the rankings, give them two votes instead of one. Coming to the second news, Carmelo Anthony's return to MSG in Manhattan. So Carmelo Anthony had his season high of 26 points and he was shooting 11 out of 17 from the field. So pretty good stats and yeah, come on Melo in MSG, it's just ah, beautiful to see that. and. As you see, second very funny story out of MSG. I roll the clip. As you see, the kiss cam got two very in love people. But guys, next time get your room because or do it some. Okay. Anyway, guys, as you see. Anyway, coming to the third news. <laughs> coming to the third news out of the day was it Michael Porter Jr. finally lives up to his potential. MPJ had a season high 25 points off the bench. And as you see, his first highlight was a mad. Was a mad sidestep. Three ball. Yeah, 25 points off the bench, as you know. He was like the number one recruit in high school in his in his time, but then he had some problems with his injuries, so he missed like the, his whole college season. Went straight to the NBA draft. Nuggets drafted him, and yesterday, yesterday, last year was his rookie season. He didn't play there any games. I don't think so. Was hurt the whole year. But now, finally plays. The Nuggets have a deep bench, so he doesn't get a lot of playing time. But yeah, as you see, he was on fire. 25 points off the bench. I want to see more of that, Michael Porter Jr. So guys, this has been the news of the week. I really wanted to tell you guys these things. Pretty funny stuff. Uh, yeah, pretty good to see MPJ ball out. But the most important thing, guys, vote for your All-Stars. I'm really excited to see the All-Star game, especially the dunking contest. Go check out my other video on how to vote for them. And guys, thank you for watching. Leave a like, subscribe. See you in the next one, guys. Have a good day.
Peace, guys.